Welcome back everybody. Here I'm just going to the Notepad++ and actually here I just opened that and what I'm just going to do here one thing more that I just typed here the posts. I'm just typing here oh not not here actually here the new post and the category so instead of the simple dashboard we have to change it. I'm just adding oh not the list actually pencil save that go to the browser and refresh that and when I just click on new post I got the new post option the pencil okay so I'm just using the sign up edit okay this is another icon which is looking perfect for the new category when I just click on new post now I got the new category with link and new post with link oh sorry not link actually the icon so this is perfect now well the other thing is which I just want to teach you in this class I'm just opening the notepad back and actually I'm just going after this column I'm just going to create another column the div and here in this column what I'm just going to do adding a class and just typing col 10 save that and go to the browser to refresh and actually I just created that but actually I'm not watching because this is totally empty the col lg10 so by the way or I think it should be the LG8 okay by the way now inside that I'm just going to create another div and I'm just adding a class actually I just want to create some blocks here okay so I'm just creating the class of call MD MD3 okay now save that and actually go inside this and what I'm just going to do just creating a panel here okay here I'm just setting the class of panel perfect now just go inside the panel and here I'm just setting another div okay which should be the panel heading here I'm just setting the class of this the panel heading okay save that now inside that just creating a raw okay here I'm just putting the class and just typing the raw okay now inside this single raw I'm just going to create some more things first of all in this column I'm just create I just created a raw and in this raw I'm just creating some more columns so adding the class here now these columns should be extra small okay so extra small and I'm just setting three and inside that I'm just creating an I okay you know the mean of I actually I just I'm just thinking to add the glyph icon again glyph and space another thing is glyph icon okay now signal I'm just setting the signal sign so go to the browser and refresh that now I just created this thing okay which is actually nothing now but obviously I'll just create some more things in the same raw okay after this column I'm just creating another column class and I'm just typing call xs and 9 okay I just created the call xs 9 and inside this xs in this column actually I'm just creating two more divs okay and here in the first one I'm just typing um, for example 20 okay and the other one I'm just typing post save that now go to the browser and refresh that this is what I just created so what I'm just going to do more here I'm just creating adding in a style tag and I'm just typing the font size what size I'm just putting approximately 4.5 em is perfect for me so save that go to the browser and refresh that now this is the size which I just created perfect so what I'm just going to do more actually here I'm just adding a, in a style here as well and what I'm just typing here in this style I'm just typing the font size again and I'm typing the 2.5 em save that and refresh that now this is the thing or the better thing is if I just type 4.5 here and 2.5 here and save that and refresh that again and actually this is mesmerizing because of its bad look by the way here I'm just adding another thing and typing another class the text on right okay 
this is a class which actually can make our text on right so refresh that now my text is on right side now this is looking in uh, this is looking a perfect thing by the way but some more things I'm just adding now actually this raw has been completed now and after the panel heading I'm just adding the panel not the body okay directly the panel footer and here I'm just typing the class panel footer okay so here I'm just typing view post save that go to the browser and refresh that and this is what I just made okay and actually I'm just going back to there and what I just want to do I'm just adding an a tag here href and at this time this only has an hash and actually I'm, I'm just covering the a tag and just cutting this footer the panel footer and pasting the panel footer inside this a tag and going to the browser back and refreshing that now actually this has a specific link which is the perfect just that I want so what more I'm, I'm, I just want to do here I'm just doing adding another divs here and ending that div and going there on the first one and just adding a class of pull left okay save that and go to the browser and refresh that okay this is perfect but one more thing which I just want to add here the pull right and actually in the pull right I'm just adding V only at this moment okay and go to the browser and refresh that this is the V and then just add a class of clear fix okay so you know the, the clear fix what the clear fix can do actually this is the clear both and it can solve the problem of floating now this is perfect okay so instead of the V I'm just adding an I okay here I'm just setting an I again means another icon here I'm just adding the class of glyph icon press any space and again type glyph icon and now circle arrow left okay I'm just talking about the left arrow which has a circle refresh that now this is the thing which I just want to create okay this is actually the ratio that how much post we have we have the 20 post so it is looking perfect so I'm going to the notepad here and I'm just typing I'm just adding some more things first of all I'm just adding the panel and actually I'm just adding this style with the panel class the panel default style refresh that and this is a default panel style looking perfect but not really interesting it means I have to do some more things here but by the way one thing what I'm just doing I'm just changing the panel uh, MD3 to MD4 so let's just refresh that now the size is a little bit increased and looking more beautiful and just decreasing the size of this area so I'm just going here I'm just typing the LG9 and this should be LG2 now save that and refresh that this is um, too much small so let's just do the same the previous one okay this is perfect but something more which I have to do here you know that this post is actually just touching the top area so I'm just going here and what I'm just doing actually just simply inside this col LG column I'm just copying this div the blank div and just pasting it inside this LG 8 and saving and refreshing that now I got some space here actually 50 pixel space at the top so that is perfect but what if I just type the panel primary instead of panel default and just go to the browser and refresh that now this is looking more interesting or I can type the danger as well save that and go to the browser and refresh that now this is another color of the panel okay so I'll do some more things in the next class so stay tuned and goodbye